Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, couple things there real quick before I start. Um, there's some type of YouTube view glitch going on. Um, vids on this page, on my second channel, are, you know, the views have went down for some reason. It's happening with other channels as well, so... If this account, if, if this video has like three views or something, it's not my fault. It's some kind of weirdo YouTube glitch that's going on. Also, I have changed the name of my backup channel to Wrestling Jesus Second Channel. And on my second channel, you're going to get some wrestling videos and some food reviews and a bunch of random shit on that account um i have uploaded or i'm currently uploading should be uploaded by the time this fits done a western barbecue burger review from mcdonald's dog what a fucking cheat day today my cheat day Felt good eating a hamburger from McDonald's. Reviewing that shit on my second channel. Um, should be up soon enough there. And now, now that we're done with all the bullshit there, it is time for my unbaggings. Um, most of you know last month I fucked up hard. I thought I was done with wrestling. I gave away my DVDs to charity. Um, I threw all my wrestling shirts in the garbage. I gave all my wrestling toys to my girlfriend's nieces and nephews. Tried to get my toys back. <laughs> and they don't want to fucking give them back to me. So I'm not going to buy new DVDs. Because they're too expensive and you can get them on the network. I don't want to look like a Gemini or something like this there. But I am going to be collecting the WWE toys. My motherfucking toys. So went and bought a bunch of wrestling action figures. The wrestling bitch went to buy that shit for me there. So... Let's get started with this unbagging. So I'm going to start collecting the toys again. Not the DVDs, but the toys. Power Slammer, Total Throttle Match, Motorized Battling Action. Not sure what the fuck it's going to do with a mortar there, but we got Big John Cena. Let me touch your penis. Let me touch your penis. And you got Batista. Let me grip your penis. Let me grip your penis. I'm going to attempt to put this together there, but with a mortar. I don't know if I can do it. I don't know if it's like a lawnmower. Before the, I, I, I set up the ring there, so... Fucking figures, Doug. Sheamus and Rey Mysterio. They all have that hand job grip, it seems like they're Sheamus and Rey Mysterio. Triple H and Roman Reigns, Doug. If you guys want, I can maybe review the figures or something like this. I got another Mysterio and Daniel Bryan. I fucking, I told my girlfriend, I'm like, Reed, tell me the fucking, all the figures that there is. I was making her tell me each one that was there. And I bought every fucking figure that was available at Toys R Us. Each one <laughs> that was there, the big sized ones. We got an oversized Alberto Del, Del Rio. 
Let him be son of Peter. Let us son of Peter. Doesn't sound like that here, but. Let me let me know if you guys want me to review this, these figures. I can try to do it there. I don't I don't know much about reviewing figures, but I can try. Eric Rowan and Luke Harper, people. This is pretty cool. These two guys there. Mr. Perfect. This was a real wrestler, people, a real motherfucking wrestler. The father of Axelmania, for those who sadly don't know that. I'm sure everybody must know. Everybody's a bunch of fucking smarts should at least know that. AJ Lee and Big E! Big E Ha! Big E Ha! Back when he was together with AJ, like two years ago or something, I don't know. Ryback! Stupid! <laughs> Stupid! Something else I might do, people. I might bring back that action figure type of show that I did once there. An older looking taker. Mmm, I got a cowboy hat. Mm. I did that Attitude Era versus uh, PG. I might do another vid like that, people having uh, the little wrestlers fighting, fighting each other for your enjoyment. Let me know if that interests you there. Another Ryback and Jinder Mahal for some reason. <laughs> Not sure why Jinder Mahal's there, but. Jinder Mahal, people, put your hands together for Jinder Mahal. Who? <laughs> Scott Hall, ladies and gentlemen, raise them all. Scott Hall, motherfuck, fucking king. Well, king of punches, anyway. True to coolest looking punches ever, raise them all, people. Sure, you might be drunk and on cocaine. But Razor Ramon was the king of cool people. That guy was the man. Another Batista. <laughs> Girlfriend bought too many goddamn Batistas. I got like yeah, two of them. One with the hand job grip and the normal one. We got the little wannabe UFC fighter there, CM Punk who's been talking trash to Hulk Hogan recently. Takes a big man there telling a 70-year-old Hulk Hogan that he's going to fuck him up there. I bet Hogan can still beat his ass even though Hogan's like 70 nowadays or whatever. So those are my new figures, the beginning of my new wrestling toy collection. I'm so happy. <laughs> Um, let me know if you want me to review, you know, figures when I buy them, shit like this. Let me know if you're interested in the rinky-dink, uh, little motherfucking action, action figure show there. Where make them wrestlers fight each other for your enjoyment. I'll end up looking like a tard, but it still be fun there. And uh, check out my second channel for them McDonald's food reviews coming tonight. I <laughs> probably do another vid tonight on this channel. Until next time, peace.